What it do YouTube, what's up? It's your boy Ricky here, um, aka Boy London. I'm jumping into this video right now to tell you why my videos got removed from my channel and why they got put back on. And basically this is how it went. As I was making the videos, as I was getting into the videos, I was enjoying the time that I was making the videos. I was in the now, I was producing them, and all I wanted to be was a big YouTuber, blah, 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 blah. That's basically what my goal was back then. I did them. And then I matured, after I finished up these videos, the, the scene started dying out, and I matured. And as I was maturing, I was looking back and seeing the chaos that was hidden. In the time I was making those videos, I saw the chaos from those videos after. Because in the time I was doing it, I couldn't see, all I saw was one goal, and that was to blow up on YouTube, you know, and make a living out of it. But so I grew up. And I come out of it, and then I was making these other videos, I went through that, and it was a bit of confusion. It was actually, actually not a bit, it was quite a lot of confusion that I was going through. And I just didn't know where I wanted to go, what to do, how to let go of all of these things. And I was just like, oh, I'm so confused here, I'm just gonna, I just need a break, I'm gonna take this all off. Because I don't want to influence people jumping off trains, I don't want to influence people climbing up the side of buildings and hanging off of things. And I just don't want to be that guy no more, that, that guy is dead to me, he's, he's gone, far gone, Psh, gone. So I just took out, I took out the videos, and I just kind of went into my own personal life, and I just really, really, really wanted to decide what I was actually going to do in my life. So I took all the videos out, w come off of social media and just gave myself some time, some time. I went through a lot of stuff then and I found music again. I jumped back onto music and then I put my music on social media, bearing in mind all the videos are still gone. So then I put my music on the, uh, I put my music back on and I was pushing all of that out and people were liking it and I just was focusing on that. Then my videos came back to me and I realized that's where I came from. And that's where I was, this is the confusion, you see. I was just back and forth battling these thoughts, emotions. What should I actually do? I was in a confuzzle, man, honestly. But then I obviously looked back and these videos come back and I realized that they made me who I am today. They're the ones that got me to mature. They're the ones that made and shaped me who I am today. The man that I am today is what my past led me to be. And... I just couldn't take them off. I realized that I needed people to see the, the change. I needed people to see where I came from when I started and now. So I was like, nah, I can't let these people not see what I went through for those, for those years. Because we went through blood, sweat and tears for those videos and for those the times we were filming. So I was just like, nah, I have to put them back on. And I just want to see the peeps. I want people to see the change in me and the development of me, and how that can work for you as well, and how things change in life, and how things can go for the best and for the worst. But you can always, always come out the best, always, no matter what. So I wanted people to see that, and I was just in a big confusion of why these videos were going and. Why I wasn't agreeing with them. Now, there are elements to the videos that I do not agree with to this day. And I do not advise you to, get, to copy any of that for any sort of fame or any sort of money. Do not be of the world. Do not let the world take you. You take the world. You can get money in the most cleanest way possible. You can get the money just being yourself. So I'd advise you to do that instead of trying to follow trends or things in the past. I would advise being your authentic self and finding where that authentic self places itself. Now, when you are your authentic self, you will naturally be guided. You will naturally find what your heart desires and where you are placing in. So that's what happens when you're authentic, your authentic self. So being your authentic self, you'll lose jobs. Being, being your authentic self, you will lose friends because you're being your true self from some people that were on the surface level and some jobs that are on the surface level of you do not like that. It shakes their spirit. So they do not want to go near you or they feel the need to repel from you. Being your authentic self <laughs> is a great thing. It's not easy, but when you, when, once you learn it, boom, 
you've you've got life by the balls literally so yeah um i just had to learn to basically stop following all these things these peoples these trends i basically pulled my entire spirit my brain out of social media out of the world for that time being went through all of this mass confusion came through out the other side and realized who i was as a person and what i'm actually going to do on this planet and I realized that I had this oppression trying to stop me and I just had to clear out my mind and get closer to my father in heaven, God, the guy that knows it all, the guy that knows everything about you, everything about this world. I just had to get closer to him and I thank him so much and I put all of my glory to him. I give all my glory to him and his son, Jesus. Amen. And I'm full on Christian, by the way, if you wanted to know, I am a full Christian. I love Jesus. I'm about God. Our God is in heaven waiting for us. After this life, he is waiting for you. You shall be judged. Be that person for God. People will see you. They will look at you differently. You will be on top, shining like their heavens. I promise you. And um, apart from all that, slide that all away and let that go to you, my, my boys and girls. But that's why I took my videos off and I took my videos back, put my videos back on. Because I want you guys to learn from my mistakes and my victories. Learn from it. It's a constant battle. I love every single one of you guys. You may not understand that and I'm probably, you're probably thinking, some of you right now, that I'm just saying it for the camera. I'm generally serious. I've got love for these people. My God is showing me why and how to love even strangers on the street. I've got the utmost love for you people and I only want to see my people doing well. Well. Amazing. Yeah? You deserve it guys. I deserve it. We all do. Push further in your careers. Push further in your life. Push further. Keep pushing Get up and smash it. Keep fighting against evil. Keep fighting against those negative thoughts. Keep pushing. You are a, you are a warrior. Much love. Him. Safe. Oh, and I almost forgot to say, guys, um, the videos are all back online. They're all there for you to stream, watch, comment, 